I use a mixer, which is obviously this one that's sitting right here. This is the mixer I use for my videos, so this video right now, and my live stream and a few other things. This is a Behringer Zenix 1002. Obviously, don't judge the quality of this mixer by what you can hear right now in this video because it's been recorded live and the quality is compressed and ruined so it uploads quickly to YouTube. But I've been asked by a viewer and a member of the community called Liam how to go about connecting a laptop to this mixer and this would the same answer would be true for any computer. I'll just switch back to the main camera, give it a few seconds, and there we go. So, all the inputs along the top are jack inputs. I'll make this as simple as possible. It's you, That is a jack. It's the kind that you get on an iPod with earphones with most audio devices now. It's the output you probably have on your computer. The inputs on here, however, use the same type of input, but it's the big version. I believe it's 6.3 millimeters. I forget which is which. Either way, you can see the difference in size between them. Now, to get a stereo source connected to the mixer, it takes two of these one for the left channel and one for the right channel. So, the problem you face is how to get from that to two of these. Now, it's relatively simple and it doesn't cost much in cables and adapters you first need one of these cables um... i'm not going <laughs> i'm not going to lie these are this is actually two separate cables i couldn't find a spare one to demonstrate but from somewhere like amazon or some kind of audio slash cable shop you should be able to find a jack two rca plugs the red and black ones look like that i got all of my cables from amazon um, I might put some links in the descriptions to some that you can buy. So um, it's a Jack 2 RCA plugs. <laughs> so that goes into the computer, the output where, like, wh where you plug speakers in, for example, and then it splits it into the two channels, the left channel and the right channel. So your next problem is how do you plug them into the mixer because they won't fit. You use adapters like these There's all you do is simply connect them to the end and then you have two jack plugs so you go from one small one to two big ones and then they would go in the mixer left channel right channel that would go into the laptop or computer or laptop or, or desktop or whatever type of computer you have now these adapters I also got from Amazon they didn't cost much at all I got loads for a few pounds I'll just put them over there these I'll again if I can link to these in the description are RCA2 jack adapters obviously and that's all there is to it to, and you can connect as one two four things in that style or you could the alternative way to do it if I can quickly find there's one I can do this without falling off my chair no I can't bear with me here the other way to do it is to use a simple jack cable with the same on both ends like that and then use one of these adapters now you just get mono audio through a mixer like this but if that's all you need then this might be slightly cheaper you might already have these kind of adapters then this is just a jack adapter does anyone in the chat know the actual measurements of these because I've forgotten them <laughs> it's 3.5 millimeters maybe the mini one Yeah, 3.5 centimeters. I have a feeling the big one's 6.3. I might be completely wrong on that. <laughs> but anyway, that that's the adapter you need, the little one to the big one. You can also get it the other way around, but 
that that would be silly. Yeah, you should be able to see everyone posting in the chat just there uh, the answers. So there there are two possible ways to do it. Either this way to get mono audio, then you can connect twice as many things, or the way I do it to get stereo audio. Need the these adapters are more expensive. These cables are probably slightly more expensive, but what you'd be spending an, ex an extra twenty pence probably. Cables like this from somewhere like Amazon don't cost much at all. And that chat you can see right there is obviously my chat to go with the live stream. You can find that on my blog, which is jacky.com, jak-e.com. You'll find a lot more there. Like I just said, my blog where I post all of my videos with written descriptions. If I review, review something, you get a more detailed review if you read it on my blog. You'll find my live stream, the live chat, and lots more. Thanks for watching.